All right, this is going to be a demonstration of my new panel. This is a Kentex Synchro. Um, you can see it's a big one, it's series 6000. Uh, and it's got a printer and a key switch. But hang on, if I open it up, you can see inside I disconnected the wire to the printer just so I didn't want to waste paper. The, the printer does work and it works well. So you have to put the paper in the right way and plus even once it's on it wastes paper because you can see this was just from starting it up all of that um but yeah on the system at the moment this is gonna uh change but i've got a discovery optical that's discovery because it's got two leds and a pulse and um xp95 uh, sound of beacon base uh, with an isolator. Uh, next up, um, we have an XP95 zone monitor with isolator, and that's hooked up to a Series 65 um, optical and a Cooper Fullion cool point. I know it's not the proper glass for it, but oh well. Uh, and then next up, um, so there's an integrated, it's not on there at the moment but yeah expect to see that in the some other system tests soon um but here's a um an intelligent um you can see that's on the end um but there's no faults because if you see there this is all just one big spur um Actually, it's not that big, but the panel pulls really quickly. It's because there aren't very many devices, but still a decent kind of pulling speed. Um, that one doesn't pull. Um, but yeah, let's um, hit the cool point. And the sound of beacon bass is um, great. Uh, I bought this off uh, Jay Fire um, or James Everett or um, whatever you know him as. Um, yeah, I bought this off him on his eBay store. Um, I'll give a link down to his um, channel. There's not much on it yet, um, but there is stuff coming. Um, but yeah, I'll leave that in alarm. Um, and then go grab some deodorant and I'll activate the Series 65. Don't want to ruin the discovery. Um, and as you can see, there's a load of stuff here. Um, there's a symphony. Uh, also under there, um, hang on, damn it. It's just gone on the floor, but there's a Sonos. Um, it's an Apollo one. Uh, well, I've also got another Apollo Sonos. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna grab the deodorant. It's just links, nothing exciting. Um, but if I um, stink out the um, Apollo, it should work. I can smell that from here. It's really horrible. But once that triggers, the light on the zone monitor will come on. Um, and then in a couple of seconds, the panel will start beeping and the sound of beacon bass will go off. Um, might need a bit more. Oh, that stinks. I don't know why I wear that stuff. It's quite bad. Hmm. Does this not work? What if I take it off its base? Will the panel complain? Oh. Yes. It does. What does it say? Oh, damn it. Um. Don't monitor internal fault. 
All right, so if I put this back on and um, this has to be enough. Oh, never mind, I'll just do the um, Cooper Fully on. And this panel's great with tone holding. Um, so I think I'll just try and smoke out the Discovery then. I can't do it to the um, Series 65. Um, so, yeah. There. Lovely tone hold, um, and as you can see, there's the 360 degree LEDs. I'll just blow this out. I hope it doesn't reactivate. Um, then I'll reset the call point. Good key. Um, and these reset from the front. It's, it's great. So you can just. Or maybe not. I am. There, it's just a pain um, when it's not kind of fixed to a wall, as it is with most cool points, actually. So, I'm going to just reset this. Let's see if the discovery is going to go off. No, I don't think it is. Uh, but yeah, this panel has 48 zones. Actually, you can program it to have more, but 48 zone LEDs. Um, and yeah. It's really good. Um, I love it. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And I hope to see you in the next one.